Chris Rodinas, Research Analyst for IT Creations, and today we will be taking a look at Dell's Precision T5600 workstation, which is the completely redesigned successor to the T5500. This workstation has support for up to two Intel Xeon E5 2600 series CPUs, up to eight DIMMs for a maximum of 256 gigabytes of RAM, and an onboard six gigabit per second SATA SAS RAID controller. Let's first take a look at the redesigned chassis that you can see looks much sleeker than the T5500 with added aluminum handles to the front and rear for easier deployment. The T5600 measures 6.79 inches wide, 16.31 inches tall, and 18.54 inches deep. Add a few inches to accommodate rear connections. In total, the workstation averages 32 pounds, give or take, depending on your configuration. Now, let's take a look at the front panel where you can see the power button, microphone and headphone jacks, three USB 2.0 ports, and one USB 3.0 port. Below this is the slimline optical drive and space to fit a 5.25 inch optical drive as well. The side panels are made of aluminum with four rubber feet for use on its side. On the back are the air vents for the CPUs as well as a hole to place a padlock. Taking a closer look at the rear I.O. panel, we can see audio and microphone ports, a serial port, one RJ45 port, PS2 for the mouse and keyboard, five USB 2.0 ports, and one more USB 3.0 port. On the bottom of the chassis is the power supply, which comes in either a 635 watt or an 825 watt model, depending on your needs. Both are 80 plus gold certified. Now, let's go ahead and take a look inside of the T5600. On the top right side, you can see the optical drive cage with the slimline optical SATA drive. Underneath this are the front system fans that draw in air for the rest of the chassis. The system's hard drives are located at the very bottom with room for two 3.5 inch hard drives or four 2.5 inch hard drives, either SATA, SAS, or SSDs. Now, let's take a look at the CPUs and DIMM slots. CPUs 1 and 2 are covered in metal shrouds with 80 millimeter fans connected to the heat sinks. With an E5 2643 CPU installed, with all eight cores enabled, you should be looking at a temperature range of 60 to 75 degrees Celsius. The T5600 uses Intel's C600 chipset and supports up to two Intel Quad 6 or 8 core E5 2600 series CPUs. Remember when using dual CPUs, they must be the same processor model. There are four available DIMMs per CPU for a total of eight usable DIMMs with dual processors installed and supported speeds of 1066, 1333, and 1600 MHz. Single, dual, or quad rank DIMMs. RAM sizes of 2, 4, 8, 16, and 32 gigabytes are supported for a maximum of 256 gigabytes of RAM. Moving on, we have the six PCI expansion slots with enough room to fit either dual GPUs or add a Tesla C2075 accelerator card to a Quadro 6000. This workstation can support a wide range of other GPUs with PCIe 3.0. Here is a list with a few examples. The onboard RAID card can support hard drives with 7200, 10,000, and 15,000 RPMs. But you can also add a PERC card like the H310 that we have in this system. The H310 can be added to support RAID levels of 0, 1, 5, 10, and 50. We also offer the H710 RAID card, which has support for RAID levels 0, 1, 5, 6, and a RAID span of 10, 50, and 60 as well as 512 megabytes of built-in non-volatile cache or one gigabyte of non-volatile built-in cache with the H710P. Now, let's take a look at the T5600's performance with some benchmarks. Using Sandra Light, the two Intel Xeon E5 2667 CPUs received a score of 229.49 gigaflops using the Whetstone Double Native SSE3 benchmark. We also ran Cinebench 11.5 and got a 44.39 frames per second for the OpenGL test with our Quadro 2000 and an 18.19 points for the CPU. Running a performance test 8.0, the 256 gigabytes of RAM got a memory mark of 2,181. 
The dual Intel Xeon E5 2690s got a CPU mark of 20,535. And the Samsung Dell SSD got a disk mark of 3,095. For the operating system, Dell recommends Windows 7 over Windows 8, but is also certified to run certain Red Hat Enterprise Linux distributions. Overall, Dell's T5600 is a huge upgrade from its predecessor, with an increase to 8 DIMMs for a total of 256 gigabytes of RAM, two onboard processor chipsets for the Intel Xeon E5 2600 series CPUs, and a sleeker design chassis with better cooling. That's all for the T5600 workstation. If you want more information, feel free to visit us online at itcreations.com or call us at 818-975-3100. I'm Chris Rodinas and we'll see you next time.